to me, the so-called biopsychosocial model doesn't capture the complexity at all. To me, you have the bio, which has got two parts, source and cause, all right? And you've got the neurophysiological, which is your neuromodulation. And then you've got your psychosocial, and everybody knows that there's at least 11 dimensions in that. So it's a, it's a much more complex than a biopsychosocial model. That's a simplistic con condensation of, of a, a much more complex thing. So when I say diagnosis, I mean, first of all, I want to know source and cause, if I can. I can't always do that, of course. All right, then I want to know what the influences are. Is there sensitization or inhibition of the pain experience or the nociceptive input? What are the psychosocial factors that are influencing how the patient behaves and experiences their nociception? All right. And so that's all to me, at one level, your pathoanatomy, all right, is your simple diagnostics. All right. Then you have diagnostics in the broad sense, which is all of that. 